In a recent video, Ray Comfort stated that his favorite disciple by far is Judas Iscariot. Think about that. Ray Comfort's favorite disciple by far is Judas Iscariot, the man that betrayed Jesus. That's like me saying that my favorite angel by far is Lucifer. It's a bit of a weird thing to say. Ray goes on to use Judas as an example to substantiate the claim that it's not enough to believe in Jesus. Despite literally scores of verses, scores of verses that I've already covered that teach salvation is by grace through faith alone. The Bible says in Acts chapter 16, for example, it puts forth the question, what must I do to be saved? And they said what? Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved? No, according to Ray Comfort, this is insufficient. According to Ray Comfort, it's not enough to believe in Jesus. By far, my favorite disciple is Judas Iscariot. He being dead for 2,000 years still speaks, and he speaks volumes. He's a signpost of where not to go and the sternest of warnings of what not to do. Judas has taught me of the self-deceptive nature of hypocrisy, of the subtlety of greed, that the love of money really is the root of all evil. He showed me that it's not enough to believe in Jesus. The foolishness of using Judas Iscariot as an example in this context lies in the fact that the word of God is clear, Judas never believed on Jesus. Notice what Jesus himself says in John chapter 6, starting off in verse 64. But there are some of you that what? Believe not. For Jesus knew from the beginning, don't miss that, from the beginning, who they were that what? Believed not and who should betray him? Who betrayed Jesus? The obvious answer is Judas Iscariot. So according to verse 64, the same man that betrayed Jesus is the same man that believed not, watch this, from the beginning. From the beginning, Judas believed not, according to the words of Christ. Look at verse 70. Jesus answered them, have not I chosen you 12 and one of you is a devil? Who's he speaking about? Look at verse 71. He spake of Judas Iscariot, the son of Simon, for he it was that should betray him, being one of the twelve. When confronted in the comment section of said video, Ray proceeded to respond by partially quoting James chapter 2 verse 19 as he often does, and then insinuating that because I teach it is enough to believe in Jesus, I must be seeking to justify a specific addiction. Look guys, mark and avoid Ray comfort. Salvation is by grace through faith alone. Stop trusting in yourself. Stop trusting in your righteousness. Stop trusting in your works and put all of your faith on Jesus Christ, what he did for you. His death, his burial, his resurrection, who he is. Trust in the Lord completely. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. If you are not 100% certain that you're going to heaven when you die, I encourage you to watch the video in the description below, How to Be Saved, The Bible Way to Heaven, and Be Saved Today. God bless.